Okay. Uh, oh. Hello, hello. Okay, wait, I pin you first. I pin you first. Uh, guys, okay. same thing. If you are using laptop. Okay. If you are using laptop, uh, you can. You need to pin my screen and also Rachel's, uh, screen. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, guys. Uh, similar to you earn just now. I have never met Rachel before. I think I've spoken to you on the phone once. Yeah. And 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 uh, that was guys. That was because I asked her to come in to share with you some, um some insights on how to score well. Uh, yeah. Uh, she scored 10 A plus. And were you expecting, first question of the day, uh, were you expecting 10 A plus? Obviously not. <laughs> like, yeah, it, was, it wasn't expected at all. Because like my trial results, it wasn't like straight A plus and all. I mean, it's straight A, but it's not straight A plus. Uh, I need to ask, uh, did you take any exam before Pachubaan? Yeah, I did. In Form 4. The year-end exam. Oh, got one time. Mm. Oh, yeah, guys, that was the, the only time. time. <laughs> you can say hi to Rachel, guys. You can say hi to Rachel. You can put public. If you feel shy, you just DM me. I'll answer the questions. Yeah. Um, one small observation that, that I have so far. After doing a few... Do, do you know that I uploaded a few sessions into YouTube? <laughs> You're not aware, yeah. right? I, I have done a few sessions. So far, the guys, um, the boys who come in to share, the class is not so active. But girls come in, uh, I tell you, the chat that I'm seeing uh, is non-stop. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so guys, on to serious questions. Uh, um, on to serious questions. Uh, uh, if you have anything to ask, you can put it public so that everyone can see it. If not, you just... You just um, DM me lah. Okay, uh, first one, what is your study routine? I think you can put it as like normal days and also near okay. week event. Okay, so for normal days, right, I usually study about like four to six hours a day. Yeah. Okay, so. Can I pause you there? Really, can I yeah. pause you there a while? Four to six hours because it's online class, right? Mostly. Mm, mostly online class, but um, that's for weekends. Uh. For weekends, oh, I week usually study six hours a day, but for weekdays, because we have class in the morning, right? So, um, actually, four hours is not really that hard to reach out, because in the afternoon, you can study two hours, and then at night, two hours. It's really not that long, uh, if you think about it that way. Uh. Yeah. Okay, so, yeah. Um... Uh, with that said, uh, um, because I, I think most of them here, they are packed with tuition. So how do you balance between yeah. tuition and tuition? Okay, so tuition, I actually count tuition as my study hour. So if there's tuition of the day, um, if there's two hour tuition, then uh, two hours is counted in my four hours. So that then I will have two hours more to study. Oh, that yeah. That's mentally, but, hey, that's mentally very comforting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but because I don't really have that many patients, so yeah. Uh, what but, subject did you take tuition? Um, I take bio, um, bio sejarah, and. Yeah, I think that's it. Huh? That's all? Uh? <laughs> Physics, chemistry don't have? Uh? No. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Yeah. okay. <laughs> <laughs> the end. Without tuition, how to score? <laughs> so for me, wonder. right? Um, for the memorizing sub subjects, like, because I'm not a very good... I, I'm not very good at memorizing stuff. So I rely on tuition to help me memorize. <laughs> I, I, I think yeah. that also because you mentioned bio, then sejarah. Yes. Hey, but bio, sorry, uh, uh, I just want to double check again. Uh, you came for a scheme, right? Mm -mm. Uh, normal class? Normal class, I attended for one okay, month. Right. 
Mm. Ah, okay. The foam foam is normal class uh, back then. The foam foam was the intensive class. Oh. I usually okay. come for intensive class. <laughs> yeah, because it's more compact. It's more compact. Uh, yeah. you, you know your, you know your, uh, you know what you want, uh, basically. Mm, yeah. So, okay. Uh, I see some questions here. Uh, okay. Study yeah. schedule. Oh, so for study schedule, right? Um... Uh, sorry, I think you so, have to. We can't really see your head. You have to move it up a bit. Ah, like this will be good. You're using okay. iPad, ah? You're using iPad. Yeah, yeah, it's iPad. iPad is normally like that one. It's like from the bottom up one. Okay, ah, okay, that is good. Okay. 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 So, okay, knowing having taking the initiative to plan a timetable is one thing, ah. But planning a good timetable is another thing. So for timetables, you really. You, you don't want to overwhelm yourself, uh, basically. So you have to plan a very wise timetable. For example, uh, you can't put Sejara and Bio on the same day. You, you, can't, you can't memorize so many, so many things uh, on the same day, basically. So what I do is, I put one memorizing subject and another subject, for example, math. Because you don't really need to study so much for maths, right? You just do questions and all. So you won't be so overwhelmed with uh with the subject, uh, basically. I think I think what you're um, doing is um I think what you're doing is because you know that memorizing subject you face some uh issues lah, or, or you find you're not so good at memorizing. So you tend to pair, you tend to split Bayu and Sejara. Bayu uh is some okay, let's say you are not that good in Bayu, you put Bayu and maybe a math. Yeah, yeah. Sejarah with a map, something like that, right? Mm. So, guys, you but can. But I have to say that uh, mm. for for math, I actually do math every day. <laughs> so. Oh, okay, it, okay. Yeah, because math is like a practicing subject. You you really have to practice. There's no shortcut in math. Uh, yeah. So take note of that. <laughs> when you mention math, is it just math or math and at math? Math and at math. Oh, okay, uh, okay. So, I plan it like this. Uh, um, for Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I'll do math. For the rest of the days, I'll do at math. Because uh, I think we all know that at math is harder than math, right? So <laughs> You don't say it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, so okay. I'll... Then, which, okay, do you always end it with math? Sorry? Do you always end it with math? Panic. No, no, and you end the end the end oh, your end. studying. Oh, uh, no, I start with math. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, interesting. I usually interesting. uh, because during I, I actually do classes at uh, do classes, but I I do math my classes. You okay? I, uh, can I say this? Can I say this? You 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 love math and add math. Are you a um, calculation person? In a way, yes. <laughs> Guys, uh, um, why I say this because uh, uh, two things, two, three things uh, signals me that she is more of a math person. Uh, she only goes tuition for bio and sejarah, memorizing subject. Number two, normally students will end with math. She start with math. Means she start with something that she start with something that she is uh, she likes to do, then get the momentum going. And she plan every day got math. It tells that it, it, it kind of tells that you you love maths a lot. Uh. <laughs> Actually, not really. La. I only started liking maths when I'm good at maths, which is uh, in form four. Like before that, I wasn't really like that good in maths. I, uh, uh, yeah. So maths is a funny subject. La. When you're when you're good at it, you naturally like it. <laughs> The, the confidence, I think it's the confidence la. Like you score like let's say 80, 90 for a subject, you start to like that subject. Yeah. Yeah, it's a true one. Okay, uh, okay, wait, uh, let me just scroll through the question. Okay, how do you, uh, just a few students DM, uh, how do you manage uh, Sejarah? Do you use the textbook? Do you do questions? Ah, uh, Sejarah, okay. So <laughs> Sejarah, right? Uh, Okay, so the first step is obviously to read the textbook. For me, I don't use any other reference book because it just it just gets very confusing because 
when you're familiarized with this tech book, you just use it. You you if you use other text books, it's sometimes very confusing. It's your so, go-to um material uh, basically for the job. Ah uh, yeah. Similar to bio. Uh, I only uh, use a few materials. I don't I think like for some every people, they, for every subject, you should yeah. have uh something like this. Uh, you the the the, uh, the book you always go to. Yeah. So the first step is obviously to read it, and then the second step, for me, it's a bit different. I like to read the structure and essay questions and also the answers. So I don't do the questions first. I, I, I read. I think I think this group is very happy listening to that. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's only for sejarah. Yeah, that's only for sejarah. <laughs> because I understand that a lot of people, after we read the textbook, it's really hard to like memorize all the facts at the same time. So it's easier to read the questions and answer. Then only you uh, understand the topic more. Oh, okay, okay. We, yeah. we in a way we call this active revision also like you are you are you are um stimulating your brain to think how to answer also, in a way like. Yeah. And then uh another way is also to teach another student now basically. So um for Sajara because it's a memorizing subject, so there's you, uh, when you teach someone, you act, you can actually remember more. Remember better. You remember, yeah, better. remember better. Yeah. But but guys, don't simply teach your friend if you do not know anything. Later you do well, your friend don't do well. <laughs> well, a lot yeah. of questions like I tell you, my hypothesis that 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 the the group respond better to girls, uh, is really correct. <laughs> it's the conclusion now. Are you? Um, what is your motivation? My motivation. To study to like to like I mean to study every day. Um my motivation. Actually, I mean since form four I always have this goal to get straight A plus. So straight A plus. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Wow. So very... Okay, means all along. Uh I think I can say this lah. Uh, she was from Awe Maria. She was from one school, went to another school lah. So last time, uh, in Awe Maria, memang your your ranking is quite good lah. I would say. Like like if it's okay top like top ten top ten lah. Top ten top ten lah. Top ten. Guys, uh, her previous school, the previous school lah, was uh the one I mentioned to you guys. Uh, is the top school in Para. The top school in Para and getting top ten is crazy, you know, in that school. You get you get top thirty on Tao Chiu Le Wa. Should be laughing like mad. The top ten is like. <laughs> no la, Abi Mara is. Okay, okay. <laughs> Full stop. <laughs> um, okay. Also, you were you were aiming straight A plus already lah. Yeah. Okay, I want to know. I'm okay. Um, uh, straight A students because a lot lah, frankly lah. Uh, but straight A plus not many. I always ask this question when it comes to straight A plus students. How did you get to know you got straight A plus? How I got to know? What? Well, how I was the morning online? like? Oh, the morning. Oh. <laughs> Could you sleep the night before? No. Okay, lah. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> how was the process? Um, I mean, I just tell myself, um, it's okay lah. If you don't get straight A plus, it's okay. Because <laughs> <laughs> like, um, I'm already studying in college, right? So, <laughs> the day before the SVM result, I just tell myself, okay, you already got your scholarship. You don't need to worry about the SVM. <laughs> <laughs> this is called cheating yourself in a way. Yes. <laughs> How many A's? She has again straight A plus. Yeah, if you just came in ten A plus, she got ten A plus. No, actually, I got nine. I took nine, nine subjects. Oh, I yeah. got it. I got it wrong. Nine A plus. <laughs> I keep getting this wrong. Eh. Uh, but but wait. Uh, so how how you you got to know your results when you were still in KL? Ah? Uh, no, I was in four. Oh, you were in four already. Oh, oh, means you went back just to. Go, just go to get my results. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> 
Yeah, actually, I thought of meeting up with you and another boy last week, but he uh, couldn't. He was in uh, KL with it, lah. Yeah, guys, I'm actually meeting Rachel next week. Supposed to be today, but today a bit rushed for us. I'm meeting her next week. Uh, yeah. How did she get a scholarship way before SPM? Don't tell her. Oh, are you? Don't tell her. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell her. Uh, um, no, no, guys, they use percubaan result. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this is a good question. Did you finish studying all the chapters for all the subjects before you do trial paper? Uh, for me, yes. Because uh, ours is the first batch, right? So, so we didn't really have any trial papers before that. Oh, wait, we do. Um, the past year. Uh, but yes, I do study all the subjects first uh, before I do trial papers. Um, what did, sir, what did she get for trials, if you don't mind? Uh, I just got straight A's. Uh. Straight A's. I think it's a very, it's a very heavy sentence for them, Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> How do you study after school? If, okay, um, yours was online all the way until November also, correct? Until your trials? Uh? Mm, until October also. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, this is the question. Uh, how do you study after school physically? Like, you won't feel exhausted. Do you take naps? Uh? Yes, I take a lot of naps. I sleep <laughs> a lot. <laughs> Like right after I come back from school, I will have to sleep on. It's compulsory. <laughs> Guys, uh, I, I've done quite a lot of sessions so far. Resting is very important. If you're mentally like you're reading but nothing is going in, it's time to close your book and take a nap. But how long is your nap? Huh? I'm a bit worried to ask oh, this question. My nap, uh, one hour. La. Sorry? One hour. Okay, la, okay. La. I think one is like maximum. Really. Honestly, for me, I think one is maximum. There's a comment. I think the secret to score straight A is by napping. <laughs> uh, don't nap too much. Uh. Yeah, don't nap too much, guys. Later, later, later it becomes a habit. Uh. Um, uh, okay, funny question. After she shower, only nap or nap first, only shower. I think you bathe first. La. No, man? You yeah. want to lie on your bed after coming back from school, uh, guys. Have you heard of Cjin uh, what uh bacteria? Yeah, bathers, yeah. Bathers, right? Sorry, it's supposed to be for you the question. You should be and here, hello. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. uh how long does she sleep? Oh, oh okay, what time do you sleep at night? Night. Uh 12. Uh. 12. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, exam time also 12. Yeah. I I cannot, uh, like, I have to sleep at 12. Because she said that sleep is very important yeah, for her. Yeah, sleep is very important. <laughs> uh, okay, weekends, what time do you wake up? Oh, so I, I wake up at 7, seven every day. Ah. Even if it's weekends. Yeah, ah, I don't okay. know, but I, I just like to study in the morning because it's more quiet, I guess. And it's good because your exams are in the morning. Yeah. Uh, okay, I think this question is, okay, this question is from me, la, but it's for them. From me, from me, but for them. La. If let's say they are scoring... I mean, from your, because you are the first batch of KSSM uh, syllabus, they, they will be the second batch. I'm from KBSM batch. The maximum I know is the KSSM bio only, the physics, chemistry, all I don't know. So um, in your opinion, now it's already end of June. If they are scoring like Bs, can they still score straight A's? Their, their SPM will be next year March. Is there still time? Please, sir. Uh, now like getting B's la, mostly. Can they ah, get straight A's? Actually, uh, yes. La. It's possible. It's possible. As long as you uh, you start now. La. 
Exactly. Yes, yes, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted to say that. Then you, then you, then you. <laughs> I see you were logicing. Uh, I mean, you were, you were, you were trying to logic how, how, how can it happen? Guys, you must start now if you want straight A's, even if you didn't do well previously. You must start now. But time actually got a lot of time. Actually got a lot of time. It's just what you do with your time only. Yeah. It's coming from someone straight A plus. I'm not. I say uh, if I say once or twice, okay lah, fine lah. This is from another uh, third party opinion uh. Uh, Do you do notes? Okay. Uh, notes. I do very simple notes. I don't do fancy fancy notes. Like I don't decorate my notes. So, uh, for notes, it's only for certain subjects like um physics, chemistry, sejarah, and biology. The rest, I don't do notes. For physics, I only write notes for formulas. Like, I write all the formulas down. I basically stick them on the wall. I think, I think, I think we forgot one very important question just now. I mean, I mean this group, uh, no, one, no one continued asking. How did you study physics without any uh, tuition? Okay. Oh. Um, I watch YouTube. Yes. Well, I better specify what YouTube because they only watch the entertainment ones, <laughs> the K-pop and all those. <laughs> I mean, there are a lot of uh, tutorial videos uh, online for physics. You know, when you know, you know about know more about momentum, uh, even quantum physics. Like, that's a lot of videos, and also because I'm interested in physics, uh, so I, I take the initiative to watch all these YouTube videos. Uh, uh, but actually, there are a lot. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, but, you don't... but you watch it, um, uh, we, we don't do mention any YouTube channels here, guys. We don't mention any YouTube channel here, lah, because I scared little got copyright problem. Lah. Um, you watch it uh, to understand the concept, or you watch it, you type like SPM physics, like you straight away. Uh, watch I watch to understand the concept first. Oh, yeah. okay, 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 okay. Then you try question. Oh, Mm, I try questions. Uh, I usually do objective questions first uh, for physics. Because typically the tougher questions come from the objective questions. I don't know if some of you realize it, uh, but more calculation questions uh, come from objective questions. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. I see, it's still the same. I, I realized that last time. That's why my teacher back then keep drilling us objective one. Keep drilling on your door structure. There's a limit. Uh. There's quite a limit to what yeah. you can ask due to the short. Now it's even shorter, the structure questions. Okay, for then structure. how about. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, for structure questions, actually, it's quite easy. Uh. Once you do more past year questions, you get the hang of it, especially for the uh, essay questions, like the modification suggestion questions. Mm. Uh, yeah, if you do more than. And then. You, you can actually get some notes from Telegram. Sometimes they compile all the modification questions together and then uh, you can actually read it. Uh. Yeah, guys, go so, to Telegram. Yeah. Go to Telegram. Yeah. The two platforms I really like to use is YouTube and Telegram. So you save uh, 50, 60 ringgit on tuition the month. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, no, guys, you search yourself. Telegram or YouTube because uh, normally I don't, I, I won't ask like your senior to give you the link because what suit her may not suit you, number one. Number two is, um, so I mean, I don't simply recommend stuff because later if you don't do well, then you blame this thing, then you, you know, there's an obligation there. La. So normally I don't, I don't recommend that. Guys, you, you find whatever suits you. La. She's just telling her method. She's just telling her method. Uh, how about chemistry? chemistry um for chemistry the foundation is very important so, what material do you use to study material oh. i guess i just use my teacher's notes uh, school uh, teacher's notes uh. school teacher's notes then guys Basically, you rely on your tuition teacher's notes uh, or school teacher uh. Basically, you really have to remember all the chemical formulas. Uh, because like, it's the foundation for chemistry. Uh, the periodic table, chemical formulas, knowing how to write chemical equations. Those are all the basic things you really need to know before you proceed to uh, tougher stuff like 
um, redox, redox equations. Basically, your form four topic is more important. Yes, it's very important. Okay, which uh, form four is important. Then I just thought there was a question I saw. Um, like like when you are form five, uh, how often do you revise the form four work? Because I think nearly all subjects form four is heavier than form five. How often do you, uh, how, how do you decide, uh, hey, let's touch some form four stuff? Okay, so for physics and chemistry, I rarely revise on form four topics because uh, it's not really a memorizing subject. So basically, it's already in my head. Uh, I don't really <laughs> need to revise. On guys, it don't anymore. guys don't do this if it's not in your head. Means <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, for bio but, la, for bio, yeah, okay, yeah, for you bio. touch a lot form four la. Okay, okay, okay. That's a good advice. That's a very good advice, guys. If you feel your form four is strong, you can spend a bit lesser time on that particular subject and attack those form four whereby you you're the weakest in that particular uh, subject la. Yeah, but if you haven't mastered your form 4 yet, uh, you really have to master it. Because <laughs> if it's not mastered, you can't really proceed to form 5 for chemistry and physics. Uh, chemistry and physics, you mentioned a few times passive question. Can I ask, uh, because I want to specify for them, when you say passive question, are you referring to your year state papers or is it like last time KBSM, the format papers? Uh, I'm actually referring to last time. Uh. Because for oh. my batch, there isn't much passive. Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, correct. Your batch, your batch is the most pitiful one. Even textbook yeah. also got so damn late. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, correct. But, but, actually, much material, yeah. but actually, for physics and chemistry, it's still quite similar, la, So you can still use the old batch. Uh, bio also, just that bio got new things. I think same goes with chemistry, physics. Uh. They add on things only. They didn't really take away much stuff. Lah. Yeah. But you got it from your seniors, I'm assuming. The past year questions? Uh, I found it online, actually. Hey? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, is it like Actually, booming everything can be found online. Bo booming ah, yeah. Milan, right? Uh, oh, okay. Uh, that one, uh, state papers though. Past year state papers. Past year? Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. So it's past year state papers. Uh. Uh, the, the common websites are uh, Bumi Gemilang and what's that one more? What Guru Bursa, that, that few. Uh. But Telegram yeah. sure got one. Telegram sure got. Yeah, yeah. But I mostly do past year state papers uh, because for past year questions, usually teachers will give us one. So. Oh. Okay, uh, when did you start? Yeah. Because uh, your SPM time uh, is essentially the same as theirs, which is in February, March, uh, March. Uh. So prior to SPM, when did you start doing these sets? Because unless you finish the syllabus, it's very hard to start also. Uh. When did you like really start attacking these papers? Uh, maybe July. Uh. Cause July. Oh, guys, it's yeah, next month. July. Guys, it's next month. Yeah. <laughs> at this point of time, you basically most of the topics should be almost fully covered. Uh, so you my can Tani, my Tani just said it's next week. Emily just said it's actually next week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we <better> start. <laughs> Uh, the problem with this batch is exactly like what Divishwa just said. We haven't even reached fifty percent of our syllabus. Exactly that. Uh, I'm currently in chapter 8.5. The school is only in chapter 4. Yeah, so I think guys, push to August. Push to August. <laughs> yeah. My chemistry, only chapter 1. Oh, you so slow. Let's redox. Take a long time. Redox. Oh, we started. Oh, yeah, you're starting to go. If it's chapter 1, it's quite concerning. <laughs> Yeah, we're trying to give them positive stuff, so <laughs> yeah. And anyway, uh, uh, when you started these trial papers, as you mentioned, the best I, I can see is very important to them. Uh, when you started these trial papers, uh, uh, how many percent of your form five syllabus have been completed? Because July, you cannot finish everything yet. Uh, 
Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, okay, my school okay. was quite fast. Uh. Oh, very fast. Uh. Very fast. So, guys, you can agak agak. You can agak agak. Once you finish 70, 80%, it's time to start. It. Sometimes it's the momentum uh, because we procrastinate. We procrastinate like little la, little la, haven't finished yet. So, you end up not doing. You end up not doing. Um. Okay, guys, any last question? You see, time passed very fast. Uh. Uh, so far, the session so far all like like over over overshoot and uh. guys, any last question? Yeah, any last question? How do you memorize fact pack factual? I think factual topics like acid, alkali, and salt. Wow, so specific. Um, acid, alkali, and salt. There's no specific. Uh. I guess same thing uh, I watch YouTube videos. That's her way, la, guys. Yeah. Her go to method lah. Does she mention with YouTube and uh Telegram? How do you recall it often? Uh, I do notes. I stick it on the wall. So every time I walk past it, uh I'll take a look at it. Uh. I need to say this, uh, please first get permission from your parents. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Later they go and use don't know what funny glue then they go and glue cannot take off. Uh. Uh, okay. Um, what course is she taking now? Foundation in science, right? Uh, I'm taking. Uh, oh yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. South Australian matriculation. Yeah, suddenly came to mind. Uh, what yeah. do you plan to take for a degree? Uh, engineering. Oh, okay, okay. What engineering? Ah. Uh? Um, electrical. Uh. Why? Uh? Why? Uh? Um, cause, cause I like maths and physics. I thought you were going to say you like electric. <laughs> <laughs> okay, la, okay, la. okay uh, any, any last advice for your juniors here? And equally, they are your juniors. Second back. Uh, yeah, so anything is possible. Just, you can do it. Uh. Not stay really, positive. Uh. Not stay really positive. that hard. Yeah, stay positive. Do you and, struggle? Or they ask, did you struggle actually? Does it seem like everything was quite okay for you, lah? Like not too bad. You struggled. It wasn't. It wasn't too bad, lah. Yeah, yeah. Consistent. Yeah. Right? She's consistent, right, guys. Yeah, consistency is the key. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, okay, well, guys. I think that's all for today, lah. Can you say thank you to Rachel? I'll, I'll meet you next uh Thursday, lah. I'll meet you next Thursday. Go for dinner, lah. Your class finish at what time? Uh, five o'clock, right? Hmm. Your class finish at five, right? Oh yeah. Ah, uh, next Thursday lah. Okay lah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'll see you next week. Thank you. Okay, guys. Thank bye. you. Uh, okay. Bye bye. Bye bye.